But going back to your, your streak just for a second. Sure. There was a point in time that I thought your streak was going to end when you took an elbow from J.R. Reed. And it was so intentional. I remember watching the highlights and I was like, Junior, go kill him. <laughs> <laughs> Man, go kick. Because I was mad for you. Because you, you, I mean, he hit you. And I know he knocked out your your, your front tooth or something, yeah. right? And it hit the ground, and you just went and picked it up. You know, I was like, boy, Junior, <laughs> turn the cheek stuff, man. Man, <laughs> man, go knock the hell out of this dude, right, man. Right, I was like, because right. I know how he did this on purpose. Right. So, but that you you did not miss a game. But my, my question is, how were you able to be so calm? Because you know when we played back in the right. day. Right. How were you able to be so calm, go pick up your tooth, and just – Take it over to the bench. Keep playing. Then I know you had to get root canal and all right. that stuff the next day. H- how'd you do that? I'm just. <laughs> <laughs> I've been thinking about this for years because I remember watching it and I'm just like, I. There's no way in hell, right? That I could have done that. I right. already know the two foot has just been over there because I would have <laughs> been throwing punches. You know, I, somebody find that for me if you can. But I'm throwing punches at this dude. How how were you able to keep your cool like that? That's number one. And then obviously. You know, you're going to have to do some major dental work. Right. And you still didn't miss a game. You, you got to tell me about that. No, well, th- two parts in on, on the dental and then just the preparation. So it's funny. Um, that morning, okay, that was a that was a national televised game playing the New York Knicks there mm-hmm. in Phoenix. Mm-hmm. So that morning, uh, you know, I, I was one who always got up and had my spiritual, my quiet time. You right, know, right, so I, I, right. I was, and I remember like yesterday, it's five, five something in the morning. Okay, game's not till obviously noon. And um, so I'm like, Lord, um, this is my this was my prayer. You know, thank you for this day. Thank you for, you know, everything, is, you know, that happens, this, that, and the other. Let me be used by you. Give me an opportunity. Give me a, give me a chance to really uh, honor you. Mm, mm. And, and I remember saying those words. And, um, and, and I said, okay, so that, I said, uh, I'm excited about it. I said, and, and let this let this game uh, let me reflect you and inspire many uh, inside this game, which was part normal of a prayer. But mm-hmm. at the same time, I knew this was national TV, also, mm-hmm. you know. And so that was that's what I went into that, and let me have the let me have the power and self control that you you have blessed me with. Mm-hmm. Had no idea what was going to happen that game. <laughs> no idea, none. <laughs> None. And so the game goes on. And like you said, okay, so that now and Jr. was my teammates told me he was mad at a couple of my other bigger guys because they had already been wrestling and tussling. So I really was a a collateral damage. Okay, okay. So he was you an intended. Yeah, I wasn't really that guy, but he probably didn't like me anyway. I don't know. You know, at that (laughs) that time. And so when that happened, um, I honestly did not think anything about getting them. I didn't think about no that till later. No whatsoever. I, I didn't think about that till later. Okay. Okay. Like, I mean, like weeks later. Okay. Like, we're going to play them again, huh? Yeah. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I'm going to get my chance. We're gonna play like, again. Yeah. And, and literally, that, that's exactly what, exactly what happened. So when that tooth did come out, and it was a bottom tooth, it came out because uh, I had my mouth guard on top. And mm-hmm. so, and I saw it. I lined up the. Um, the ref, the ball went out of bounds. I lined up for our out of bounds play, and then uh, I felt like a little. I saw one of my teammates went like, and and I'm like, and I felt a little stinging mm-hmm. going on inside my mouth, and I'm like, you know, you, right, you're, you're right. in the action, right, you ain't right. think about nothing. So you're flowing and everything. B, I did that. I did my tongue swipe left to right, and then went left to right, and then there was a gap. <laughs> <laughs> I said, uh-oh. <laughs> Hold on. Something missing. So, that ain't normal. <laughs> that, ain't, that ain't right. <laughs> and I came back the other way. I'm like, I'm like, that was a mistake. Something not. And I went back the other way. Uh-oh. I'm like, oh. And so I looked, and I just looked down, and I saw my, I saw my tooth. And it was literally, I can reach, I just bent over, I grabbed that, it, yeah. and, and I'm like, my tooth, my tooth's out. <laughs> and I grabbed my tooth, I put in my compression short, I rolled it up, put in my compression short, shorts, and I, and I lined up for uh, the out of bounds play. And then now the ref, someone, you know, one of the guys said something to the ref, and so the ref, he's, he's looking at me like, you looking at me right now. Right, right. And so I turned my head. 
I turned my head, wiped off the blood over here, and then I t- and I started running the play, and and I, with my head turned like this, and he walked on the other side. Yeah, you want to see that blood? Too. Yeah, he <laughs> wanted to get you out the game. Say, you got. <laughs> I'm like, he said, you got to go. <laughs> and so, sure enough, I went. Um, it was more important for me to find my tooth than get J.R. Reed on that particular day and right, at, right. at that time. <laughs> and, and literally, we got the tooth, went to the doctor, uh, did some, had work done that night, stabilized it, and then the team left right after the game, went mm-hmm. to Utah, played mm-hmm. the next night. Uh, they saw how I was doing in the next morning to make sure everything was good. I'm like, I'm good. Listen, you know, I told him that when I left. Oh, I'm good. I'm good. You know my boy Lee Johnson, my boy Lee Johnson. Okay, Lee was in town that weekend. My high, this is my high school uh, fr- buddy and college um, college roommate and all that. So he happened to be in town from Texas, and so and he was like already on the court, like trying to get oh, you. I, I remember Lee. Yeah, yeah. yeah Lee, Lee wasn't. Turn another cheek. No, no, Lee. Mm-hmm. Like, man, I ain't got no cheeks, man. <laughs> so, <laughs> let me out of. So he he stayed with me uh, and to make sure everything was good. And so I wind up playing. So we had a back to back. So we played Utah that very next night. We played Utah. So I went in, uh, got in about two o'clock that afternoon. Flew in on my own. Went in the locker room. The guys like they saw a ghost. Right. They're right. like, you here? I'm like. Yeah, let's let's go. <laughs> Come on, where my uniform at? And right, there it is they, in the locker room. And so, so they did have it in the locker room. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was there because they they. I told them. Uh, you okay, know, so you yeah. had already warned them that you were coming. Yeah, I was like, yeah, you better have my locker, my, my <laughs> uniform ready too. Sure enough, so it was. It was a crazy, crazy twenty four hours. So and um, but I do honestly remember that because it was probably one of the most pivotal times and moments in my life where I, I really. Ask to be used by God and do something special, do something miraculous, do you know, use me in whatever you want to use me. Right. And that was the way in which he sort of saw fit to to uh yeah. turn the other cheek. Turn yeah. the other cheek and show show uh some amazing grace. Yeah. So I would have been like, Heavenly yeah. Father, I'm gonna have to apologize uh to you because I'm gonna knock the <laughs> hell out of him. <laughs> I, I, I'll I'll get to the room and be like, I'm, Father, I'm sorry. I, I I'm sorry. Use me tomorrow. <laughs> Use me tomorrow. <laughs> exactly. Because the day after that, I'm, I'm about to kill him. <laughs> oh, being the funny part, man. Seriously, because we, like I said, we were going to play them like two weeks down the road, and uh, and so we played them a couple. Um, with the next, the next time we were coming. And now you got all this time to right, think about right, what happened. You heard right. about what happened. You saw the replay because now you got to talk to the league and the, you know infractions mm-hmm, committee. Like, mm-hmm. okay, what happened? Do you instigate this? Who was the aggressor? Like, who's the aggressor? <laughs> <laughs> Look at the team. Look at the team. <laughs> Who got their tooth on the ground right. running, running around the stadium? <laughs> and, uh, and and sure enough, so that next game it was coming, man. I remember I, I I told my guys. I said, I said, look. I said, you know, we playing them all right. They said, yeah. I said, I said what's, they said, what's up? I said. Just check on me. <laughs> said, just check on me. I said, just m- make sure. Make, I said, I'm not. I'm not kidding you, man. Before we go out there, I said, I'm good now. Right. I said, but I, I'm. I got some thoughts. All right. So Ooh. I'm just letting you know. I said, so before we go out there on that on that layup line, I said, you look at me. I'm telling you because I know me. Right. So please right. just just make sure. I'm, I'm. You know. And they said. All right, I said, and, and if you see the first time we get we get anywhere mm-hmm. close, one, I said, just be close, right? Because right? I don't want a reaction. <laughs> you know, just like, <laughs> don't know what's gonna happen, but y'all oh, be ready just yeah. just in case. I had two or three two or three bodyguards on the court at that time just to protect me from myself. Right, yeah, right. that was the crazy thing. I'm like, because I said I'm just not positive, but everything was fine. Everything worked out. It worked out cool. Okay, cool. Well, still, <laughs> Jr. I know you're around somewhere, Mr. Reed. I love you, but dog, it'd have been a tussle, bro. Yeah, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna lie, we'd have been tussling. 